I am making this video for two reasons. Reason one, I wish to flog HHO Info's latest video on the on-demand, under-the-hood oxyhydrogen devices that a hell of a lot of people out there are purchasing. Either they're purchasing the devices, they're purchasing parts for the devices, they're purchasing plans on how to build them. And you're damn upset at being defrauded. You can check out HHO Info's video and you can see one solution. Report to the Federal Trade Commission. That video explains how. <clears throat> the second reason is to make this video. I want to once again iterate. It has been now three years since I've been trying, begging, pleading for the the producers, the sellers, and the promoters of these on-demand, under-the-hood oxyhydrogen devices. I have been begging them to let me give them money so that I could test their devices. Once again, one thousand dollars, let me Test your device. <clears throat> if you say that your device is increasing your vehicle's fuel economy, I want to give you a thousand dollars. I want to test your device first. If your device actually does what you say it is doing, improving your vehicle's fuel economy, I will give you one thousand dollars. That one thousand dollars, by the way, is uh, coming from HHO Info, he has donated that. <clears throat> and if for some reason he can't provide that money, I will provide it myself. So, you're covered for at least $1,000. If you let me test your device, three years, not a damn one of you promoters, sellers, believers out there will let me do that. Why? I'm right here. I am eager, happy, ecstatic to test your device and give you $1,000. Why won't you take my money or HHO Info's money or both of our money? You will see my proposed protocol for testing in another link down here, which I think is more than fair on testing these devices, what excuse could you possibly have for none of you? There's got to be tens of thousands of clowns out there who are building these things, who are selling these things, who are promoting these things, who are insisting that these devices improve their vehicle's fuel economy. Not one of you will step forward and let me test your device and hand over $1,000. I will hand it over in $1 bills if you like. I will hand it over in $5 bills if you like. 20s, 100s if you like, 50s if you like. Hand it over immediately. Once your device is tested and shows that it does what you claim it does. Where are you out there? Come, let me test your device. Let me give you some money. What could be the holdup? For example, in HHO Info's um, comment section for his latest video, we have a YouTube user named Jose Guillermo or something like that. I'm very sorry. I don't know how to pronounce that. He states, quote, Well, my HHO is working. I got a 1,999 Ford Expedition I used to get 12 MPG. Now it is 18 MPG on city and 23 on highway. No punctuation. No capitalization. Grammar is fucked. But let's ignore that. Let's look at the numbers. He is claiming a six mile per gallon improvement for his vehicle with one of these on-demand, under-the-hood oxyhydrogen devices. 
a 50% increase in fuel economy. That falls well within my protocols for testing these devices. He can step forward, let me test his device in his vehicle, if it does what he says it is doing. I immediately hand over 1,000 United States dollars. I don't get it. Why wouldn't somebody come and take my money? Think of the fame. Think of the fortune. As I mentioned in previous videos and on my Watercar Challenge period com website, $1,000. I will also remove every single video on YouTube that says, that I have said in those videos, that these devices do not work as claimed. I will remove every single one of those. I will upload, make and upload at least two videos stating I was wrong, stating that your device does what you claim it does, and if I can afford one, I will purchase that device, and I will never badmouth these devices again. And a thousand dollars! I don't get it. Why doesn't anyone out there flogging these devices, selling these devices, uh, promoting these devices, building these devices. Tens of thousands of people out there claim these improve fuel economy. I can't find a goddamn test out there, not even one, that actually shows that. Step forward, please. Let me test your device. Please. Please. A thousand dollars worth of Please, <sighs> contact information if you accept the water car challenge period com is on my website. And by the way, please go check out HHO Info's latest video on how to complain to the Federal Trade Commission if you have been defrauded by either purchasing one of these devices or purchasing the instructions on how to build it. Hmm. <sighs>